Hi everyone, this is John Smith here hosting the latest episode of the Style Talk podcast. Today I'll be sharing some tips on how to choose the perfect full-length mirror for your home. Mirrors are such an essential part of any home, especially for those of us who like to check our outfits from head to toe before leaving the house. But with so many styles and features to consider, it can be tough to pick the right one. Fear not, friends. I'm here to simplify things for you in my signature casual yet comedic way. First up, let's discuss some popular mirror styles. Wall-mounted mirrors are great space savers, but don't move around much. Freestanding floor mirrors give you flexibility to place them wherever, but take up floor space. Then we've got over-the-door hanging mirrors, cheap and easy for renters, but you gotta take them down each time you open the door. My personal fave is the cheval or swinging mirror, so fancy and fun to tilt back and forth like the diva you are. When it comes to quality, you'll want thick, distortion-free glass for an accurate reflection, but the real MVP is tempered glass, stronger than regular glass and shatterproof too. Fancy. Frame material also matters. Wood looks nice but high maintenance, metal and plastic are durable options, and make sure the back isn't too ghosty. Lighting and placement are key too. Put mirrors near windows or use lamps, but not direct opposite bright lights to avoid nasty glares. My tip, add disco ball mirrors for maximum rave vibes. Finally, regular cleaning and protection will keep your mirror looking fresh. Dust it, use a streak-free cleaner, and protect from humidity. So in summary, folks, consider your style, quality, and lighting needs. A nice full-length mirror is an investment that will serve you well, whether you're dancing or primping away for years to come. Till next time, stay stylish.